Hello there, Mark Cunningham here. And in this video, I'm just going to show you a couple of ways that you can send remittances to your suppliers after you've paid their bills, including how you can send them after you make a batch payment. So let's jump into Zero now and get started. So one way you can do it is to go into the bills section and then go to your paid bills. And then you can click on the bills that you've paid. So let's just go to this ABC furniture bill, for example. And down the bottom of the bill, you can see here it's got this payment. So this one was paid in full uh, with one payment. So we've just got the one there. But this also applies to part payments as well. And if, if that's the case, you might see multiple lines here um, for payments. And for those ones, you can send separate remittances to the supplier. So for this one, we've just got the one payment and we'll just click on it. You can click on this link or you can click on this link. They'll both go to the same place. Okay, so you can see now this has actually taken us to the payment transaction and we're actually in the bank accounts uh, part of Zero now. So from here, you just click on options and you can send the remittance by email straight out of Zero, or you can um, have a look at the PDF first. So let's just open the PDF and you can apply a uh, branding theme to it. So we'll just use that standard one. Okay, so this is it here. This is the remittance advice. So I'll just close that. And then we'll just go and hit send. And from here, you can just email it to the client straight out of zero, just in the same way as we've seen um, the ability to send emails for other things such as invoices and bills, etc. So you just need to make sure you've got the email address in, uh, check the details, change anything that you want to change, send yourself a copy if you want to, and then click on send. And that will send the remittance and the PDF to the supplier. Okay, so that's how you do it. I'll just cancel out of here. And I'll just show you another way you can do it is instead of going into bills, you can go into the bank account section and then go into the actual account from which you made the payment. And then you'll want to come across to this account transactions tab. And you can just go down again and just find the payment that you've made. So let's just go down and we'll do this central copiers payment. And once again, you can see it's just brought up the payment transaction and it's the same thing. You can go in and have a look at the remittance and then you can uh, send it to the client straight from zero. So we've already done that, we won't do it again. I'm just showing you another way to get to it. And the last thing I'll show you is for batch payments. So we made that batch payment earlier. You can click on that. And like we saw in the batch payment lesson, you can just send the remittance by um, clicking on this button here. And then once again, you've just got to make sure you've got all the email addresses in there, um, that everything else is right. Make whatever changes you want. Send yourself a copy if you want and then click on send. Okay, so that's how you can send remittance advices uh, to your suppliers after you've made payments to them through Zero. Okay, that's it for this video. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you'd like to see more free videos and also check out the links in the description below for our Zero courses. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.